like Jesus. Nobody. Do me 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 like Jesus. I can't find nobody. Do me like Jesus. Nobody. Can't find nobody. Can't find nobody. Can't find nobody. 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 N
Do you like Jesus? Yeah. Nobody. Nobody. Do you like Jesus? Nobody. Yeah. Nobody. 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 Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey. You ought to give him some praise. Hallelujah. Yeah. Nobody. 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 Can I get a like Jesus? Yeah. When you can't find a friend, a mama can't do you, daddy can't do you. Like Jesus, like Jesus, like Jesus, like Jesus, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. 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 Oh, hallelujah. Yeah. In times like these, we need a Savior. In times like these, we need a Lord. In times like these, we need a Savior. In times like these. We need the Lord yeah. in times like these. We need a Savior in times like these. We need the Lord. Yeah. Be very sure. Be very sure. Be very sure. Your anchor holds and grips a solid, solid, solid rock. I said, in times like these, in time like these, we need a savior. Savior. In times like these, in times like these, we need the Lord. We need the Lord. Be very sure. Be very sure. Be very sure, be very sure. Your, anchor your anchor holds and grips a solid, solid, solid rock. Solid rock. The rock is Jesus. Jesus. He is the one. The rock is Jesus. Be very sure, be very sure. Your anchor holds, your anchor holds, and grips a solid, a solid, solid rock. Solid rock. I said, in times like these, in times like these, we need a savior. We need a savior. In times like these, in times like these, we need the Lord. We need be very sure. Be very sure. Be very sure. Be very sure. Your anchor hold. 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 And grips a solid. Solid. Solid rock. Solid rock. Oh, in times like these, we need hey, Jesus. Hey, hey. Glory in times like these, you yeah. gonna need the Lord. Yeah. You better be sure yeah. that your anchor holds. Yeah. That your anchor holds. Yeah. And grips the solid rock. Yeah, yeah. The rock is Jesus. Yeah. He is the one. The rock is Jesus. Time like this. Hey, hey. In time like this. Yeah. Oh, we need Jesus. Yeah. We need him. Early in the morning, uh, in the midday hour, late at night, you can call yeah. Jesus. 
He's on the main line. Just tell him. Tell him what you want. Tell him. Tell him what you want. Yeah. Tell him what you want. He's never too busy. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Hallelujah. In the morning. In the morning. Oh, when I rise. In the morning. Oh, when I rise. In the morning. Oh. I got my 
war clothes on in the army. I got my war clothes on in the army of the Lord. I got my war clothes on in the army. I got my food in my hand in the army of the Lord. I got my book in my hand in the army. I got my book in my hand in the army of the Lord. I got my book in my hand in the army. I'm a soldier 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 in the army. I'm gonna fight until I die in the army of the Lord. I'm gonna fight until I die in the army. I'm gonna fight until I die in the army of the Lord. I'm gonna fight until I die. He's all right. 
testimony. Glory to God. Well, we will open up the floor. Amen. For you to testify. God, one more time on the day. I thank God. Hallelujah for our leaders. Glory to God on the day. Apostle and First Lady Emmon. I just stood to say hallelujah. I'm so glad to know, hallelujah, that I belong to Jesus, hallelujah, and he belongs to me. Glory to God. Amen. Standing over the building. Amen. Yes, Jesus. Hallelujah. hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory hallelujah. To God. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm going to go ahead and give my testimony. Amen. I just want you to know on today. Oh, hold on one second. Uh, hallelujah. The Lord is a awesome God. He's a good God. Hallelujah. And like I said, I'm so glad to know that I belong to God and he belongs to me. Hallelujah. He said it in his word that we belong to him. Hallelujah. Once we give our lives to him. I just want you to know. God is good. Yeah. The Lord has blessed me. We closed the deal on my three-bedroom home. All right now. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Three bedrooms. Two beds. Oh yeah. Hallelujah. Three bedrooms. Two beds. Over half an acre, about three quarters of an acre land, almost 16, All right now. Yeah. Almost 1,600 feet, square feet on my home. I shot that. All right now. Yeah, God. Huh? Can't nobody huh, do me like Jesus. Huh? Here's somebody on the day. Huh? I talked to a neighbor on yesterday over there. She told me huh, that a lot of people tried to get that home. Huh? That was my home. Huh? That was mine. Hallelujah. Huh? Oh, glory to God. Huh? I got it for a steal of a deal. Huh? This is a brick, a brick home. Hey, God, hallelujah. The Lord is good. Yes, huh? the time. Glory to God. I got fought so many times. Hallelujah. It wasn't because of my... I want to tell you about when they uh, blessed me years ago with that little workers' cup money. Hallelujah. I didn't spend it off. Business, huh? I paid myself yeah, out of debt. Look out, I paid myself out of debt. Huh? Oh, glory to God. Huh? I've been debt free now. Oh, God. Huh? For many years. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Oh, 
for the stock time. I paid everything off. I couldn't even I couldn't even get nothing on credit, huh? Because they said, huh, you don't have anything, huh? So God Almighty, I had to get me one credit card, and that's all I got. And I pay it off, huh, Shata? Oh God, when I use it, I pay it right back off. Shata. Hallelujah, because it's good to have something, you know. Yeah, Hallelujah. Yeah. But I tell yes. you on the day, huh, the Lord is good. Huh? Yeah. I know I looked crazy for a while. Huh? Yeah. I didn't have no money. Huh? But I tell you what, huh? the Lord had paid me. And, huh? Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. And I thank God for my home on the day. And not only that, huh? he paid huh, for the repairs honey the old shot that's all right glory to god hallelujah huh? and if it be his will huh, some appliances have already been paid for stove refrigerator microwave and all that dish washing hot water heater is gonna have to be replaced hot huh? shot new pack yes sir hallelujah working on getting the floors and kind of top hey god the roof they say the roof ain't for about five years old. God, I just thank God. He's so good on the day. And I love him. Oh, God, I love him. And he let me know. Hallelujah. He's a bit He let me know more and more how much he loves me. And I just thank God on the day. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you. Hallelujah, Jesus, because nobody knows. Hallelujah, when you go through something, huh? hallelujah, I preached a little message to him, while back, huh? the Lord will take you to through and to, huh? take you to the blessing, huh? take you to the blessing, huh? I mean, to the test, take, yes. take you through the test, huh? then he'll take you to the other side, huh? and the other side has a blessing, huh? hallelujah, there's going to be some more tests, huh? but the other side has a blessing, huh? the Lord is awesome, and the Lord is Oh, my God. Uh, hallelujah. Uh, I haven't told it all. Uh, this ain't all of it, but I'll get to it. Uh, Thank you. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. How the testimony. Yeah. Glory to God. Uh. Ah, go ahead and praise him. Oh, hallelujah. Ah, yeah. <laughs> put a praise hallelujah. on it. Yeah. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Hey, hey. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It's already done. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yes, it is. 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 It's already done. Yes, it is. 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 Yes, it is.
Testimony, baby. Yes. Amen. Tell of his goodness. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. I said I didn't need no mic, Erica. Oh, hallelujah. <laughs> God is good. Yeah. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Yes, yes. Let me tell you. I had a vision. I, I was sharing with Apostle and First Lady about my vision months ago. Y'all, let me tell you. It just dropped in my spirit. Dropped in my vision. I never, I don't know where it came from, but it came. And I was looking. And I was looking. I said, I don't see it, I don't see it, I don't see it. Because I was trying to get what I saw in my vision. And I would go and I start making phone calls. And I still didn't see what I want. I said, no, I said, I, I got to describe it to your pastor. Because I said, it looked like this. And it made like that. I say, but it's a Jeep. I never wanted a Jeep before. But my God, I can say I have a Gladiator 2022. Right. And, it's, hey, hey. and it's parked up front. Wow. Apostle oh, see these vehicles. And I was driving. But I'm going to tell you, I ain't given up on my Jag now. Yeah. I have not given up on my Jag. Yeah. But this was in my spirit, and I said, Lord, if it's for me, I leave him with it. Not right. the well I saw, All right, but now. when you front, you don't see All my right. gladiator. But that ain't God move. Amen. You just got patient and waiting. I'm not trying to be like the. I'm trying to move as God open my doors. Also, out front, you see a black 2022 dollar. All right now. All Ooh. right. Good God of mine. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. He Glory to God. Double. Right. Hallelujah. Y'all know the day? Right. Elder's birthday. Right. Hallelujah. 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 As, as, as you hold on and do right for the Lord and do what you need to do for the Lord. So on these seeds and giving and, and, and being obedient willingly, he going to open doors. And I'm like, I'm like, oh, prophet, I ain't going to tell it all. But when you go out front, you're going to see it. Oh, yeah, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, uh, yeah. Hallelujah. Uh, oh, yeah. I'll be all right. I'll be all right. I'll be all right. I'll be all right. After a while. After a while.
guess what? We need the word. Yeah. Hallelujah. So y'all, get ready. Get I ready. Mean. Get ready. Get ready. After a while. Oh, oh hallelujah. After a while. After a while. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Get ready, y'all, because see something on the inside. Yes, God. Man, okay. brought about a change. See, it brought about a change. Hey, 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 hey. Something on the inside, working on the outside, brought about a change in my life. Oh, yeah. Oh, something on the inside, working on the outside, brought about a change in my life. Oh, oh, what a change. Oh, what a change. Oh, what a change. surprise for you on this fifth Sunday fellowship service. Well, our first speaker, have you ever heard about to pray go? Well, see, they say it's in there. The pray go is it's in there. Well, the word is in there. Uh-huh. And it's getting ready to come out. Hey, hey, hey. So get ready as I bring to your front this first woman of God. Hallelujah, she's coming up with power. So get ready, as I get ready and standing on your feet, everybody, as I bring to your front, missionary, Nora Wilcox. Oh, hallelujah. Something on the inside, working on the outside, brought about a change in my life. Woo. today. Glory to God. It's been a long time, but I thank God. I thank God on today because God gave me another chance, y'all. God gave me another chance. Oh my God, yes sir, to get it right with him. Glory to God. I just give God the praise on today for what he's doing and what he's done and what he's getting ready to do. Glory to God. I give honor to God on today. Glory to God because he is worthy of the praise. Amen. He is worthy of the praise. Glory to God. Oh, my God. Yes, sir. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy for the testimonies. Glory to God. My soul cries out. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you. Glory to God, because if he done it for you, and if he done it for you, he can do it for anybody else, because he said he has no respect to person. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I'm not going to be before you long. Glory to God. I'm going to sing just a little bit of this song. Glory to God, and I'm sorry. I give honor to our leaders on today, Apostle Willie J. Emmon, First Lady Emmon, to my husband, Ella Wilcox, to all the ministers of the gospel, to you, you, and you. Glory to God. I'm just going to sing just a piece. Not going to be a long one, but, you know, I've been through the storm and rain, but I made it. I've been through the storm and rain, but I I've been through the storm and rain, but I made it. I thank God. I thank God. I made. I made it. I had so many hard. 
heartaches and pain. I'm talking about me, y'all. But I made it. I had so many heartaches and pain. Heartaches and pain. But I. to God. God is a good God. I've been through the storm and rain, but I made it. I'm here today because God allowed me to be here. Glory to God. God didn't allow COVID to take me out. God didn't allow this world to overtake me. I thank God on today because he allowed me to walk into this house one more time. Glory to God. And I ask y'all to pray with me and for me. And before I start, I want to do a little prayer. Glory to God. Father God, in the name of Jesus, God, I come to you once again, God. Ask you to let me decrease so that you can increase. God, have your way in my life, God. Let me speak what you have me to speak and not what Nora want to speak. God, have your way. Touch the people's heart that we, they will receive, God, in the name of Jesus. We give you praise, honor. We give you glory. Amen. Glory to God. And I will be coming from Psalms, the 23rd chapter. Glory to God. Glory to God. And I will begin at the first verse. Amen. And it says, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. Glory to God. And that's all I'm going to read on that. Glory to God. Because... The Lord is my shepherd. Glory to God. Many times we go through trials and tribulations. We go through storms in our life. But the Lord is our shepherd. And if I will leave a thought with you, my thought will be I've been through the storm, but I'm not reformed. Glory to God. The Lord is my shepherd. We may be go through situations in our life, but we got to know that we have to look upon the Lord. We have to focus on the Lord because he is our shepherd. Glory to God. Amen. We have to know that if it wasn't for the Lord, who was on our side, where will we be? Glory to God. Glory to God. Many times the devil tried to throw trials and tricks in our way. But we got to know that we have to focus on the Lord. If we don't focus on the Lord, everything that comes in our mind, we will try to do. Glory to God. But I thank God for being my shepherd. Amen. I thank God for being my shepherd. Because without him, I can't do nothing. Glory to God. The Bible tells us in Psalms 37, he say, fret not thyself because of evildoers. Why? Because the Lord is my shepherd. Glory to God. In Psalms 37 and 4, he says, delight thyself in the Lord and he shall give you the desires of your heart. Why? Because the Lord is my shepherd. Glory to God. Psalms 30 and 5 say, weep in May and do it for a night, but joy comes in the morning. Glory to God. Why? Because the Lord is my shepherd. Glory to God. Trust in the Lord with all that heart and lean not on thy own understanding. Why? Because the Lord is your shepherd. Glory to God. Many times we go through trials. Many times we go through situations. But I'm going to tell you this. The devil tried to throw Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego in the fire of furnace. But they weren't worried about a thing. They weren't scared. They weren't scared because they knew that God was their shepherd. Glory to God. They knew that if the Lord could let them go in there, that he was going to bring them out. Glory to God. Why? Because the Lord was their shepherd. Glory to God. Even with Daniel, glory to God, when they put Daniel in the lion's den, they knew that Daniel knew that the Lord was going to protect 
him from the lions. Glory to God. Why? Because the Lord was his shepherd. Glory to God. Glory to God. Amen. Glory to God. Oh, my God. Yes, sir. Even with Job, God. Glory to God. Even with Job. Job got sick unto death. Job lost everything that he had. Oh, my God. Yes, sir. Job wasn't worried about a thing because Job knew that if God took him to it, he was going to bring him through it. Glory to God. Why? Because the Lord was his shepherd. Glory to God. Even with Noah, Lord God told Noah to build an ark. My God, yes, sir. God told Noah to build an ark. They know that Noah didn't care what people thought about him, what people were saying about him. But Noah kept doing what the Lord said do. If you continue to do what the Lord said do, the Lord will bless you. Glory to God. Even with building that ark, glory to God, the rain started falling. Glory to God, the rain started falling. Glory to God, and God closed them up in the ark. Glory to God. And God, God has saved Noah and his family in everything that was in that ark. Why? Because the Lord was the shepherd. Glory to God. Even with Moses, glory to God. Moses was running from Pharaoh. Moses was worried because he knew the Lord was going to bring him out. Moses ran. He went through the Red Sea. The Lord opened up the Red Sea for Moses. He held him. He held Pharaoh back. But Moses and his people can make it through. Why? Because the Lord was his shepherd. He says the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through the pulling down of the stronghold. Why? Because the Lord is our shepherd. Isaiah says, 54 and 17, no weapon formed against us shall prosper. Glory to God. Hallelujah. No weapon formed against us shall prosper. Why? Because the Lord is our shepherd. I've been through the storm and rain, but I've been through the storm, but I'm not performed because the Lord is my shepherd. Y'all pray much for me that I continue to do the will of the Lord. God Almighty, didn't I tell you? Hallelujah. What a word. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. <laughs> the Lord God is my shepherd and I shall not want, 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 shall not want. Just hold on. We got one more. We got one more speaker. Good God of mine. Where is there a word from the Lord? Is there a word from the Lord? Yes, there is another word from the Lord. Get ready. As I, she read it back there. As I bring her to your front. Evangelist Eugenia in mind. Shall not walk. Shall not want, 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 shall not want,
To God, apostles, first lady, and they respect the place. Everybody in their respect the place, Lord. I thank and I praise God for being here. Father God, in the name of Jesus, take me out of self, Lord God. Let this word come forth. Let it be edification to your people, Lord. In Jesus' name. I started out to want to talk about uh, can these bones live again? But you know, on these last two nights, I just want to throw in there because it's still stirring in my spirit. That pool of Bethesda. See, when I thought about the pool of Bethesda, I thought about that man laid there for years. What could have went through his mind? That man laid there. Was he thinking, should I give up? Was he thinking, I'm never going to make it? Was he thinking, don't nobody care about me? What was he thinking as he laid there? He laid there, might have laid there in pain. Doubt came. Depression came. Everything came into his mind as he laid there, waiting day after day, year after year, for that pool to stir up, praise God. And then the, when it did stir up, the time came, praise God. And Jesus asked him, he said, man, ha. he asked him if he wanted to be healed. Now let me tell you something. Sometimes we think, being healed is just physical. Sometimes we think it's, it's because it's our mind. But let me tell you something. It went deeper than that. That man had to be healed from depression. That man had to be healed from doubt. That man had to be healed from his sins, praise God. That man had to be also healed naturally. So when the Lord asked him if he wanted to be healed... And he said, yes, Lord, but no man put me in there. There was doubt. You depending on somebody to put you in there. That wasn't the question in mind. He said, do you want to be healed? Praise God. That doubt should have left. He should have just rolled out on faith. But see, when God healed him, he did it all the way. He didn't have to it. He didn't partial do it. But he did it all the way. Hallelujah. I want to tell you uh, my thing today. Uh, it was candies uh, that bones live again. Uh, you think about uh, just them bones, uh, but it's deeper than that. Uh, let me tell you. Uh, you all know uh, the Israelites, uh, they were taken away uh, into captivity. Uh, but that remnant, praise God, that remnant, praise God, that he was trying to bring back to Israel, that remnant, uh, that mess, uh, the leftovers, the rubbish, uh, that's what God wanted to use, praise God. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. Uh, let me just go through this a little bit for you. You will find me in Ezekiel 1, hallelujah, going down through 14, praise God. The hand of the Lord was upon me and carried me out in the spirit of the Lord and set me down in the midst of the valley, which was full of bones, praise God. And caused me uh, to pass by them uh, round and about. Uh, and behold, uh, there was a uh, very many in the open valley. Uh, they say that valley uh, of dry bones, praise God. And lo, uh, they were very dry. Uh, not just a little bit dry, uh, but you know when you throw a bone out there uh, and the sun hit it uh, and it's so dry. Uh, that it turns white. And he said unto me, Son of man, can these bones live? And I answered, O oh Lord God, thou knowest. Again he said unto me, Prophesy unto these bones and say unto them, 
want you to know, I want you to know, we in graphic Jews, we are part of Israel. I want you to know, God showed a power such as brittle bones to Ezekiel and asked him, can these bones live? In other words, can anything be done with this mess? Can this situation, can it change? Can your mess be made whole again? Can your doubt be brought to faith? Can you live again? If you have a mess in your life and you're trying to run the devil off, run him off your property and keep him under your feet, you can do it with words, with the word of God. You can say, listen, big mountain, hear the word of the Lord. Listen, you bigness, hear the word of the Lord. Listen, you property, hear the word of the Lord. Hear the word of the Lord. Hear me, you torment spirit. Hear the word of the Lord. And Ezekiel done as God told him to do. And he prophesied to them dry bones. And they came together. The sinews, the flesh come upon them. And the skin covered them. And Ezekiel prophesied to the wind and the breath of them entered into their dry bones and they lived and they stood up exceeding great hopes. The word of God can take over all of our situations. What are you saying in this dry bones? What are you saying to your dead circumstance? Are you prophesying to your dead bones? Or what is it that you're saying to make them more dead and dry? Nothing in my life is ever going to change. Every time I get a dollar, the devil takes it away from me. You heard that said, it never fails every time. I think something good is going to happen. I get attacked by the devil. If that is you, what are you saying? Then you ought to just ask for that trouble because you're not standing on the word of God. Every time you speak that way, you're giving the devil the right to use his power. Instead, learn how to speak God's word and neutralize Satan's power. Don't talk about how you feel or what you think. Don't look at your life and what you don't have. Open your mouth and talk about what God has promised you. Open your mouth. See, once you change your words, it's all over for the devil. There is nothing he can do against God's word. You got the victory in Christ Jesus. Oh, church, can these dry bones live again? Oh, church, come together one by one. Each ministry, each person in your calling and make one body, a body that's for Christ. Can these dry bones live again? Hallelujah. Glory to God. Didn't I tell y'all? They brought it, didn't they? Lord, have mercy. See, just like fire. See, Jeremiah said it's like fire. Shut up in my bones. 
Shut up in my mouth. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Jeremiah said it's like fire. Shut up in my bones. Shut up in my bones. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Jeremiah said it's like fire. Jeremiah said it's like fire. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Today, the word, the word, the word. Well, missionary Wilcox, she said, I've been through the storm, but I'm not conformed. And uh, evangelist Eugenia Emma, she said, it can these dead bones live again. Woo, fire, fire. Woo, that's going to take us on next week, on down, through the week. Hallelujah. But you see now. We're going to move on a little further. And we're going to call our deacons to our front at this time.